Let me know when you're ready. I'm rolling. I'm Jennifer. Oh, I don't. I didn't start out with Jennifer. Okay, yeah. sorry. You can start. Uh, start and stop again. We come to you from Cedarhurst, Long Island, at a Judaica auction house that is featuring some rare finds of actress Marilyn Monroe. And the reason this is so rare is because of her marriage to Arthur Miller. We have our curator, historian, Jonathan Greenstein. Tell us a little bit about what came from Christie's, Marilyn's personal belongings. Uh, in 1999, uh, there was an auction at Christie's of Marilyn's personal objects. Uh, inside of it were a couple of pieces of Judaica, Jewish ritual objects. One was her sitter, or her personal prayer book. Um, after a lot of research, we found that this temple, uh, the Avenue and Jew Center, was, r was right where Arthur Miller was living when he was approximately 13 years old. Probably this bar mitzvah sitter. Hang like that. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And that's uh, after he was in Harlem, and then he came to... Yes, yeah. He, uh, he was in Harlem as a young child. Uh, his father had, from what I read, some financial difficulties. Moved to the Gravesend Neck area of Brooklyn. Uh, from an old-time member, I found out that this was his temple. That's where his family attended. It was a conservative synagogue at the time. All right, we're going to start over one more time. Yeah, sure. Sorry, Frank, I have to start over. Okay. Um, first of all, I, I had no place to put the book, so I'll go set back. And when we say this, we have to go really fast okay. on this. The other thing, we can't edit this, so we have to just say this whole thing has to be like 45 seconds. Yeah. Like that. Sorry. Sorry to you. 